Hello everybody, it's Francesco from uh, Yola Community Italia here and uh, we are taking a quick look at the brand new Selfish OS 2.0. It's the early access release which will be rolled out to all the YOLA users in the following weeks. We are talking about the build number 1.1.9.28 got the name Enahem in Lampi and there are a lot of big changes uh, starting right from the lock screen. Here we have the brand new uh, status bar which shows you the battery percentage, the operator name and uh, various connectivity options such as Wi-Fi, 3G, Bluetooth, etc. The big clock right in the center with the um, date and you can perform various actions right from the lock screen for example with a swipe from the left you go into the events view with a swipe from the right we unlock the phone and um, with a swipe from the bottom uh, we have a uh, quick access to all the apps installed in our YOLA and uh, with a swipe from the top we have the this new ambient selector um, here we can lock the phone or pick our favorite ambience and here you have your home screen Instead of being a vertical oriented UI, now you have this horizontal carousel which you can endlessly scroll. On the left you have the events view, on the right you should have the partner screen, but it will be added only in the next Selfish OS update. So, so far you have only these two, these two views. Here you have all your open apps, which you can now rearrange in, in any position you like. And uh, a cool thing is that a newly opened app no longer goes to the first spot but it goes to the last one for example if we open the YOLA store it will be in the last position and another big change which may not please the old time users is that the quick actions on the covers now are triggered by a tap on the icon instead of sliding with uh, from left or right on the cover so for example if you want to perform a search in the YOLA store you have to hit the lens button on the store cover and that's all for those who are worried about the lack of a dock if you have no open apps here you have only this empty canvas you can just tap on the home screen and this four shortcuts will pop up of course uh, this is just the first row of the um, of the upgrade so you can customize those four shortcuts with the applications you use the most let's go to the to the events view here you have the uh, weather widget but now it can be expanded with a tap on it to show the forecast for the following days and if today I had an appointment, it, w it will be showed here, right, uh, right below the, the um, weather widget. And here you have all your notifications grouped. You can dismiss them one by one or the wall group here. And now even Android applications can trigger sounds, vibration, LED so there's a tighter integration between Selfish OS and the Android applications if you are in an application either a native one or an Android app you can quickly jump to the home screen with a swipe from either the left or the right and you can also pick your notifications with a swipe from the bottom you go to the app tray with a swipe from the top you go to the ambient selector and from here you can quickly lock the phone 
also control your music player stripe from the lock screen. In, in the change log only the default one is mentioned but in fact you can control any MPRIS enabled music player from the lock screen. For example if we are in the flow player we lock the phone and here we can go to next song back pause or play there are also new stuff from the settings for example here you have the ambient settings which are moved from the gallery app and here you can pick your favorite ambience in order to be displayed in the top menu and you can of course customize your ringtones notification sounds as usually then you have something that may please the long time YOLA users here you can choose if a swipe from the left brings you straight to the events view if a swipe from the top close the application instead of triggering the top menu then you have the events settings you can choose to show weather forecasts and calendar events and then you have the presents settings which are moved from events view here you can choose which up chats you want to be online in Thanks everybody for watching. If you like what you saw, please click on the thumbs up button below. It's been Francesco from Yolo Community Italia. See you.